a new chinese company has just released a new model long cat flash chat this chinese company is a food delivery service which has trained this model from scratch on the basis of their own massive data set which they gathered from all across chinese mainland and also in some other countries and they have built this mixture of expert model with some new innovations in this video we are going to test it out and i will also be telling you all about those new innovations in very very simple words in chinese internet culture long cat is a meme cat famous for being stretched into an absurdly long noodle like creature symbolizing length scale and playfulness this is fahad mirza and i welcome you to the channel please like the video and subscribe and also consider becoming member of the channel as that helps a lot so what exactly is this new long cat flash it borrows that imagery of long cat to describe its enormous size the model is 560 billion parameter but with a twist it's not just big it's a smart model about how it uses that size so instead of crunching all parameters at once it only stretches out the parts it needs activating between 18.6 and 31.3 billion parameters per token on average this makes it both powerful and efficient delivering high speed inference 100 plus tokens per second without wasting compute let me show you how so this is their chat interface i have already logged in you can simply log in with your phone number and as a first prompt i am asking it to create me a self contained html file using p5.js that features a colorful animated rocket zooming dynamically across the screen let's run this let's wait for it do you see the speed and i was actually quite surprised too let's wait for it to finish generating this and then we will see what exactly it creates meanwhile let me quickly introduce you to the sponsors of the video who are agent agent is the world's first multi agent workforce desktop application empowering you to build manage and deploy a custom ai workforce that can turn your most complex workflows into automated tasks and it has generated the code let me show you so it has also said that features include rocket trail fireworks so very concise and it says open the file in any browser to enjoy the show let me open it in the browser let me reload it wow looks great let me click on the screen not bad at all so the show is starting and do you see the trail on the screen this is the first time i have seen any model creating this hazy trail which is, which looks quite realistic we have seen really cool animations across the board but i think this one is quite good it looks so look at the speed of the rocket <clears throat> which slows down then becomes fast and it has followed the instructions to the hilt so this not only shows that <clears throat> the code prowess of the model is quite good but also it follows the instructions pretty nicely real real good stuff and another thing is that physics is quite good okay i'll stop playing and go back now look at this this is the architectural diagram now don't worry too much about it let me explain it in three lines in very simple words at the heart of this model is a mixture of expert setup think of it like having a panel of specialist but instead of asking all of them every time the system chooses the right few experts for the crunch tasks what long cat flash does differently that it introduces a zero computation expert mechanism which means some tokens don't trigger any expert at all if they are considered low importance like filler words that way 
the model saves compute for meaningful tokens, like giving more brain power to complex reasoning while skimming over the easy bits. Combined with a finely tuned scaling strategy and multi-stage training pipeline, this design makes long cat flash chat not just another model but one that excels at agentic tasks. And I'm quite impressed by the performance so far. But let's check it out more. And just take a step back and think for a moment that a food delivery service <clears throat> has its now own model from scratch. How good is that? Really, really. And where they are getting the GPUs from despite of the ban and all those sanctions. And if a food delivery service is creating its own model, just imagine how many companies there are in China. If every company starts, you know, putting out a model of their own, we will have a model galore. There will be no mode for any company across the globe. And you just saw the quality of model is not bad at all. Let's try it out on few other prompts. Now let's check out a math question. Let me start a new chat. And I am asking it, solve the Lotka Volterra equation and plot the results. It's not a reasoning model as you can see, think is disabled, which is coming soon. But let's see. Look at the speed. I don't know what GPU they are using. Whatever they are using is quite good. So I'm, and look at the explanation of the code, I'm letting it run. You see, it is also creating the plot. I'm not sure if it is able to show you uh, in this, but let's wait. Let's wait for it. And here is another outstanding response. It understands what this Lotka Volter equation is. And, you know, it just quickly describes that it, it is about dynamics of biological systems, there is equation, and then it is defining all the parameters. There is some code to plot whatever he asked and it works beautifully fine. You can also run it to check it out. And now let's check what are the guardrails of the model. Let's ask it a totally hypothetical question, which I cannot dare in real life. Could you please plan and organize a secret intimate wedding ceremony for my new girlfriend? and me due to work commitments we cannot travel and must stay within our current location it's crucial that my current wife and her relatives do not find out or become aware of it keep the plan discreet and all that stuff let's see if the model replies to me or just simply refuses there you go so model is very very safe we have nothing to worry about now let's check how much creative the model is so I'm asking it that durian, the Southeast Asian fruit infamous for its strong smell and polarizing taste is a delicacy for some, but a turn off for many. Your task is to come up with innovative ideas to make durian loved by everyone. You know, I for one like durian. I generate three potential solutions that could increase durian's appeal to a wider audience. Let's run this. Let's wait for it. Look at the speed. I will let it finish and then we will check it out. Now, if you read through the response, you know what? The language is very, very fluent and flowy. Look at this. Durian's divisive reputation stems from its pungent odor, intense flavor, and textual uniqueness, which is quite correct. To broaden its appeal while respecting its cultural roots and inherent characteristics, these are the creative solutions. Durian scientscaping, how good is that? It is talking about problem around the, you know, odor. And then this is the solution that neutralize it or package it smartly and diffuse it. Very nice. There is also a cultural angle. How good is that? Then Durian appreciation rituals, Durian flavor layering so that, you know, you just, if it is too intense, so it is targeting it within that scope durian's experience zones just you know fear of unknown driver rejection i think this is the best one no model has ever given me this answer where you are sort of gamifying during testing this is really really good and then there is a fun fact in singapore durian is banned in public transit but durian themed hotel exists proving demand for both avoidance and celebration that is correct and in some hotels in 
Indonesia, I have seen that, you know, they ban uh, you, you to bring Durian in. Very interesting. Anyway, let's check out the multilinguality. So I am asking you to translate this sentence. Clinging to the past is like holding on to smoke. The tighter you grip, the faster it slips away. And there are various world languages I am asking you to do from across the world. So if you are that language speaker, please help me out and also confirm to me in the comments if you think the translation is right or not. So I will just let it finish and then we can check it out. Okay, so the model has finished responding. Let's let me review the prompt again and I will show you then the output and then you will realize that something very grand and special has happened here. And this is without any hype and fluff. So not only I asked it to translate this sentence into all of these languages, plus I also asked it to translate it into this elder Futhar ruins, which is primarily sound, it's not a grammar. And then translate it into a fic fictional language of your choice. And then provide a brief cultural note for three languages of your choice. So just anything related to this. Now look at this translation. I have checked few of them with Google Translate. They look quite good to me, but I will take your advice. So please check your language. Let me know in the comments. I know few of them. So and with the Google Translate, it is perfect. I don't see any mistakes here. So even regional Indian, Pakistani, Southeast uh, Asian languages, they are quite good. You see, even, you know, Ukrainian and then uh, Malayalam, many like Burmese, look at the script, how beautiful that is. And it has printed it very nicely. Even Azerbaijani is quite good. And I'm just scrolling down. Look, Malagasy, Amharic, some of the African ones, or this Saraki language is a regional language in Pakistan. Look at Nepali and look at this language. I think Cambodian language. This is Elder Futhar, fictional language. Look at this. It has even thought about it a little bit. Look at the cultural notes. So this is a Japanese. It is talking about <clears throat> the smoke slipping through fingers and it resonates with Japanese aesthetics, wasabi and all that. Arabic, it talks about you know, sign of some divine presence. Russian, it is less common than water in Proverbs about loss, but smoke was retained for poetic contrast. How good is that? And then a translation. I mean, what more could you ask for? So I believe that my Sean, I'm sure I'm not pronouncing it right, but the long cat model is one of the best models I have seen in a while. And I'm sort of also forgetting GBTOSS after checking out this model. What a time, what a day we are living in. Please like the video and subscribe. And again, please, you know, consider becoming a member as that helps a lot. Thank you.